Make sure to check us out on Patreon for early access to uncut reactions to this and other shows, as well as polls, exclusive movie reactions, and other perks. Links are in the description. Berserk, episode 16. Oh my god! <laughs> What's up, guys? It's JV, and I'm back with episode 16 of Berserk. They're mounting their... So they retreated, and now they turned around. They're mounting their assault. Well, they're going to defend themselves against the the assault that's coming up on them. Griffith just gave a cool speech about the upcoming battle, and then to, to live is to be victorious. And we're going to see his master plan and what the heck's going on. So... Let's check it out. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And let's get going. Oh! Where the hell did they come from? Casca! Ah! Oh, yeah! Forward! Didn't they have... Yeah, this was their... They, like, they separated their, their army into two different flanks, right? Escape, now, escape, the, the castle's escape, empty! Escape, oh, escape, my escape, God. Because of the stupid... Uh, what is he? Governor. What an idiot. This guy's here? Goku does all the voice acting of the other guys. <laughs> this guy again? His eyes gone. Damn. To the rescue. It's you. <laughs> okay. Take care of him this time. Look at him. Well known as the indestructible Baron Adon. Oh, he has a... Oh. What? Super strong heavy assault knights. Now oh. I intend to have my revenge for our previous battle. Damn. Do not allow any of them to escape with their lives. Charge! Oh, shoot, man. This is not good. I'll avenge my brother Samson's death. Ah, Griffith. I have a report. There is a single horseman of great skill who blocks our way to Count Griffith, able to gain any ground against him. Aha. Useless is what you are. Get it, get it, get it. Holy! God damn it, guts! Oh, Lee, they're all scared of him. And he's fighting on his horse. General the Scar. The general will. Holy! His horse is so armored up. Oh! A sword didn't break in his weapon, whatever that is. Oh! Shoot! Oh! Blow for blow! We have no place in the middle of that fearsome battle. This guy never dies. He's like Goro. He's like Goro from Power Rangers. Goldar, sorry. He's like Goldar. At least wait till I'm finished speaking. How about shutting your mouth instead? Destroy them! The future of the Hawks rests on victory here! Yeah! Oh man, Hawks are dying. Oh no! Yeah! Tiny. Pippin! Pippin! I am Pippin. Damn! I am Pippin. It's just a matter of time before we're wiped out. We're outnumbered. Little Ricket has gone completely mad. Oh! Oh! We see this to the end. Oh, little Ricket wasn't the sharpshooter. That was a different guy. My army has completely overwhelmed them. These guys, man. Damn. This is that strong? Is strong. Closer to death now than when I was slaughtering 100 men. What? What about when you fought that demon? Everything on the line now, or I die. No. That scar. I've been through worse. Yeah, the demon. Yeah. This hopelessness is nothing compared to what I felt. Tiny. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's watching. Freaking uh, demon. Uh, Kumon. I beg your pardon for my lack of courtesy. Please forgive me. <laughs> After all, I'm just a lowly commander following orders from the general. I'm the last person who would ever stand in your way, and he's I surrendering. Thank like you for sparing my life. <gasps> my she's... clever ruse has now he's dead. God. Oh! Koska! That was Russia Jinrai, the secret out of the crossbow sneak attack. The tip of the oh. was poison, and that poison will numb your entire body. Your days of sinful deeds are over. I thought she was Evil dead. Evil bitch! 
<gasps> the gut gut sword broke. Oh my god, what the hell is sword broke? His freaking sword, man. It's broken. Damn it. My sword must have cracked during the last battle. Kneel before Zod. That's halfway. I can't believe Guts' sword broke. Here I come! Okay, kill this guy already, I man. He's such a clown. You around and take that. Oh, whoa, whoa. This guy's pretty good. Like, as goofy as he is, he's pretty good at fighting. I'm going numb. Oh, no! Get away from her! Come on, Casca. You'll get. Are her arms and legs should be dead. with your legs! No! Yes! What? Wow. Spin and slice. Now! Wait. The rest of them are now matched. Cut them down! She cut his head in half? Uh, is that what the sound was? Top of his head rolling off? Man, they should have showed it. He's got a tiny knife. Get back! You're no match for him! Oh no! Oh Lee, he's scared. His eyes are shaking. Akuman is checking it out. He's watching. What the hell is he coming in to Oh he's throwing him his sword! What the hell? Guts! Take that sword! That What's happening? Why did he, why did he do that? Oh! On the horse's head! Oh my god! That was like Game of Thrones, man. He did it! Sebastian is an invincible knight. What are you doing? Fight on! I am in charge now. We must continue. We still have the upper hand. Do you hear me? Transformed for sure. <coughs> oh no. Oh. Yeah! Haha, <laughs> yes. Your head has been cut off. Hey, your Amanda. general is dead. And your castle has fallen. Don't tell me you haven't figured it out yet. <laughs> we lost? You idiot. Everyone give a shout! For victory! The governor screwed it all up. What an idiot. Yes. Let them pass if they flee the battlefield, but should they resist, exterminate them all! Pass. Everyone wait! I am the commander in chief here, and I am still alive! Oh, they knocked him down. This is good. This is dope. Good, man. Now what? Are they going to kill this guy? They better kill this guy. And free all those kids he has captured. Or put him in a dungeon or something. I, we've always helped one another. You are going to let me escape unharmed, aren't you? I even gave the soldiers strict orders. That you are absolutely not to be harmed. You understand the feelings I hold in my heart, don't you? Not a day has passed that I haven't thought of you. We loved each other passionately on that night. You don't bear any ill will towards me, do you? I do not bear any ill feelings at all. Oh, my heart. Gosh. However, it upsets me to hear you speak of us making love. What? For I feel less than nothing. But... I took advantage of an opportunity, and it just so happened it was you that was there at the time. I simply picked up a pebble that was lying in my path, and by mere chance, that pebble was you. Oh. <laughs> you bastard! As you can imagine. <gasps> Holy. Oh. That was so sick. <laughs> right in his face, so fast. Are I didn't even right? see it. It was I'm so fast. That sword, holy. Hey, good job. It's ridiculous. It's so big. Hey, are you hurt? <laughs> Is that his new sword now? Almost as tall as him. Whenever I see Griffith surrounded by his comrades like that, my heart is filled with sorrow because he seems so far away from me. Let's go. <laughs> it's time to go and greet your commander. 
just left the sword. What are you going to do? Is he going to use it? No. It couldn't have been. What is up with this demon guy? The hell, man. The time ah. of the great eclipse draws near. Soon the demon kings will descend. What? Demons are on the way. Oh, no. Because of the services he has already provided, he will receive the position of general. Outrageous! His majesty will soon give him and his hawks the title of white knights, previously borne only by the white tigers and white dragon knights. He'll have supreme command of the entire army. Absurd. Now he will be able to take even more license with the king. However, yes. it appears... Do not fear. <laughs> oh! The queen. Your majesty. Feel free to leave everything in my hands. Oh, the queen. All right, so uh, more of the like the bigger plot is revealed at the end, which is amazing. First of all, Griffith's plan, okay, flawless plan. They uh, Casca's. I was like, "Where's Casca?" And then she was she was part of the second battalion that that snuck into the 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 castle. The sandstorm, all the wind blowing in the sand, really helped out. Griffith planned everything. So they couldn't see them like, I don't know, they went around and um, <clears throat> got in. Griffith knew that the counselor was up there and he would send all the the men after them like like an idiot and leave the. And then he made that stupid proposal where he's like, if you catch Griffith alive, I'll give you anything you want. So that made everybody just disobedient. And the, the general guy, the rhino general, was like, don't say that because now no one will listen to my orders. And he wanted to stay at the castle to figure out what Griffith's plan was, which was intelligent. That was a smart thing to do. He doesn't know what he's going to do. He's, he seems like he's trying to draw us in. So let's stay back. He can't get the castle. They have less men. So we'll stay here. You know, we can't. That's we're good. You know, like that's that's a smart thing to do. And. um the king is like, no, go go get him and stuff. And then it was so cool. And then Grif uh, Guts was fighting the commander. And he couldn't beat him. That was unbelievable. I've never seen that before in this show. Someone, a one-on-one -on -one fight. Guts was potentially going to lose. Even against the demon. He would have lost against the demon eventually. But he fared better against the... The demon than this guy, he cut it because actually, maybe not. His sword was damaged from the last fight, the hundred men that he fought, the hundred mercenaries. So it might have been cracked from that fight, um, especially against Samson. Remember, he was he kept blocking all those the giant mace that the, the Samson guy had. So that might have like made his sword a little more brittle. If there's one crack in it, another hit, you know. Um, so that was the biggest reason why he he was losing because he lost his sword. So I think at full strength and his sword being intact, he would have beat that guy. But still, he struggled against him. Sword was cracked. The demon was watching from the cliff and threw his sword down. And as soon as he got the sword, he slashed, cut the horse's head off and his head off, which was awesome and i feel bad for the horse which is disgusting I, I don't like to see animals get hurt like that but it was very similar to the scene in game of thrones when um uh what's that guy's the mountain cut his own horse's head off it was like the first or second episode it was so gross man i was like i felt so sorry for that horse it's not real but i just felt bad it's just it didn't do anything and it, it just the way it was so graphic anyway different show um and then uh so um yeah as soon as that commander was killed all their men were like kind of demoralized and they couldn't believe it and then Casca fight fought the that other sh i forget i don't know his name the goofy kind of like guy that kept coming back the goofy general he but he was pretty skilled with the sword he's really sneaky and um, he was like kind of giving up. He was groveling because he was outnumbered, outmatched. 
And then he had a sneaky plan to shoot her with a crossbow. And she was like, all right, that's it. Like, no more playing around. Like, I kind of let you live for a while because you're kind of interesting. And um, he was a little bit funny and stuff. But she was like, you just tried to kill me with a sneaky attack. And then I'm just going to kill you now. So she flipped over him and sliced his face. And then blood started going. I think she sliced his head in half. That's what I think. And then you hear like the you heard, you heard it. You didn't really see or or the 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 the, the blood like psh. she might have just cut his face, but I think she cut his whole head off. You know, and then, but uh, I, they should have shown it slide off or something. They're already so graphic. Come on, but um, I, I'm pretty sure he's dead. But he's come back many times before. But I'm pretty sure he's dead. His head is cut in half. So um, they they took they took the castle, and then um, Griffith confronted the counselor guy, which I hate. Like any type, yeah. Obviously, he's like the worst person ever, and he was like in love with Griffith. He's confessing his love to him, and he always thought about him and all this stuff. And Griffith's like, "You're nothing to me. You're just you're just a pebble. I just you were you were on the way to like." I saw an opportunity and I took it. It could have been anybody. And he like the guy's like, oh, what do you mean? And then he kind of got mad for a second. And then right away, Griffith's like, Whoop! and then like so fast. And he put his sword like in his head. It was gross, but satisfying at the same time. Like that guy's scum of the earth. He deserves to die. So hopefully all his all the kids that were captured by him are free and they'll get good homes now and stuff. So anyway, so that happened. And then the end, all right? This was the most exciting part. No, the whole thing was exciting, but this is this is a very interesting part. That demon guy said the eclipse is coming soon and the the de- the six demons or I don't know if he said six, but the demons are coming or some kind of demons are coming. <laughs> so there's a bunch of demons coming and he helped guts. So I don't know I don't know what's going to happen. Maybe he, he, he'll want Guts to fight with him or something. Or he's grooming Guts for something to take out the other demons. I don't know. But very interesting stuff. I wonder if Guts will use his sword from now on. Or he'll fix his, his own sword um, and keep using that. But And then at the very, very end, the... Uh, what's his name? Varys is uh, his name is not Varys, but he reminds me of him is scheming with the other the other uh i don't know i don't i couldn't recognize them there are other pol- politicians in the king's council and they're very jealous of griffith because they see that he's going to become uh part of the king's guard and he wants to become king and they could see all that coming so they're going to try and poison him and then the freaking queen is in on it too she wants him dead as well so um, we're gonna watch another episode, so stay tuned for that, guys. Check out the next episode on Patreon right now. Head over there, join up. It's about time. You've been watching these for a while. It helps support the show, and you get early access and um, reaction, the whole reaction. So it's really cool over there. I add stuff to that place all the time. We're gonna start adding movies and stuff there too. So um, definitely check that out. Check out the links down below if you're interested in anime gear, anime hat shirts, accessories, posters, all that stuff will be in the links down below. Um, So check that out and subscribe, comment and hit the notification bell for more Berserker. You get Berserk every single Friday, every Saturday. Yes, Saturday, one episode on YouTube, one episode on Patreon. So uh, stay tuned for that and I'll see you on the next episode. I'm out of here. Peace. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.